Hill in their home whites with the purple numbering and lettering. In goal for the Skyhawks, making her first save. Hannah Copley back into the middle. So Lord will have to backtrack, gets it to a midfielder and a boot, and the shot goes wide. Shut out in the opener. Nickerson will launch, curves off towards the left, a deflection down in front is Clement, the shot, it's going wide. And that was Cameron Temp Thompson on the shot. Players coming off the backside, could have got to it in time for a deflection, and there's a nice ball and a dive by Vargas, just wide. Tuck one towards the box, Lord, trying to track it down, there goes Lord Vargas aggressively to a Giambanco, trying to punch it in and it's wide of the post. Giambanco with a nice ball to the opposite side of the box, off the head and into the back of the net. <laughs> Behind, Giambanco from the left is coming on was McNeil. Giambanco a shot and it's off the side of the goal. Another good play from Giambanco, a little wide. Could have been a clean look. Near side pass from Guidi to Clement. Guidi from her backside gets it ahead to Clement. Tripped up over the ball, but she's right back up. Giambanco doing her thing to the far side left. Giambanco with a ball towards the middle, connecting with Thompson, but it's wide out of bounds. Burnham with a blast, and that's in the back of the net. Taylor Burnham from the parking lot makes it 2 0 Stonehill. Anderson. Gonna look through a wall of four Skyhawks, launches one, Copley with help from the crossbar. May have gotten a piece of it with her hand as well. Pops up high, Schultz, lost the foot race to Marino. Marino, ahead for Deal, Deal with a shot, it's off the post. Dumaresk resets up top for Guidi, Guidi. The ball ahead, looking for Giambanco, behind the defense, the one-timer is a shot and a save made. By Pravada, her first since entering the game. One last launch by Queens College, and Stonehill wins it. They move to 2 and 1 on the season. Yeah, our defense has come out really strong this year. We have some new faces in the back, and everyone's been holding up their part and doing more out there. And we are we love to have a good shutout, so that's always important to us. But I think it really came down to that playing down a player. We have to all come together, co come closer in, and just we showed grit out there and we played the hardest we could and we didn't let anything back behind us. And props to our goalie Mia for coming in and doing a great job in her first collegiate game. Yeah, I think we showed the values of Stonehill soccer to play to the last minute and just play your hardest and leave everything on the line for the team. Yeah, I mean, as a center back, my only opportunities usually come from corners or set pieces. So whenever I go up there, I just know to look for the ball and do anything I can to get up there. And when I'm going up for the header, that's all I think of is putting in the back of the net. So I hope to inspire other girls on the team to just get up there and put your head on it. Yeah, we're looking forward to Franklin Pierce. Should be a mostly new squad out there seeing what they have. And I think all any 10 games are important. So we want to keep the win, winning streak going and get those three points for conference win. Yeah, I think uh, zero in the back is always important, especially as we jump back into conference play next week. And, you know, we were able to move some players around, get some collegiate debuts here, which was great. Um, but it was, a, it was a grind. It's a physical game, just as any grind is. So, you know, we just look forward to getting back into training this week and preparing for Franklin Pierce. Yeah, game management is always important, especially when we have to make adjustments in the lineup. And it's just about staying together and communicating on the defensive side, especially, and still looking to take those opportunities when we have them going forward. Yeah, Peyton's been an aerial threat, you know, since she arrived here on campus as a freshman and now as a junior. You know, really embracing her role and that, you know, she's going to hold down our back line as a center back, but an opportunity to get forward on corner kicks, on set pieces, she's certainly always a target that we look for. Yeah, it'll, it'll be a good match up there at Franklin Pierce. Uh, they're a good program. And, you know, obviously with Matt uh, on the reins up there, I think they'll be, as always, just a battle. And we'll go up there and see if we can bring home three points.